As we celebrate Armed Forces Day 2020, it's important to remember the sacrifices that the Armed Forces community has made on behalf of our country and how it's our responsibility to support them as they move forward into new careers beyond the military. Transition from the military into the civilian world is often a complex and unsettling process, which many are unprepared for. Along with relocation and financial pressures, the cultural change is mentally demanding, which can lead to an individual not knowing how to proceed. Within days, an individual can lose their sense of identity and purpose, they can become unemployed and they can struggle to apply their skills and experience. Whereas previously they had status, were respected and embraced responsibility, they can quickly become isolated and disenfranchised. Across the construction industry, there's a severe shortage of skills leading to rising costs and an inability to meet government construction targets. Further to this, the veteran community is significantly underrepresented within the industry, with few clear pathways into employment. We at Project Recce believe that we've got a solution to this. We bring together a unique combination of skills and experience from the military and the construction industry to deliver a bespoke programme and roadmap into the construction industry. Through a comprehensive understanding of the transition process, we've created an innovative programme within a strategic network. This ensures that the right people are selected, empowered and supported through the course into the correct construction career streams. Simultaneously, we advocate the service lever as a positive and vital pool of talent for the construction industry. That's what we do at Project Recce. Project Recce was created by veterans who'd experienced the difficulties of transition, who'd experienced the pain of having mental health problems that were undiagnosed and they were unable to be fixed. We came together and we learned the best practice on how to move forward into a new career and we realised that the construction industry was a perfect fit for all of the transferable skills and experience you develop through your career in the military. We built a network, we learned how to develop the skills, how to target effectively within networks, how to reach the employers and communicate effectively exactly what we could offer and we began to deliver courses. We've been delivering courses for two years now and we've supported over 150 people into construction careers. All of these service leavers are then able to move out into the construction industry and start to set up their own networks, which then they can use to help further service leavers to move into the industry. This is Armed Forces Day. And Armed Forces are always going to look out for each other. They're always going to support each other no matter what. And through Project Recce, we've been able, we've been able to provide a community whereby people can reach out into the construction industry and support each other into new careers to ensure that they're able to maintain the correct mental health, that they're able to correct, maintain the correct support networks, the correct counselling, the correct coaching and the correct mentoring so that they can move forward and demonstrate to the wider country how effective it is to have service leavers within the construction industry. So I wish you a happy Armed Forces Day and hopefully you will enjoy the rest of your weekend.